As with any part of an apparatus, the pressure relief valve does need to be maintained on a regular basis. If the relief valve operation is sluggish or erratic, the cause can usually be traced to fine sand, grit, or other foreign material clogging one of the valves or the strainer. At least once a month, follow these exercise instructions to ensure proper relief valve operation. Begin by engaging the pump, opening the tank to pump and tank fill valve, and throttling up your pressure to 150 PSI. With the pilot valve off, remove the strainer assembly and clean the strainer and the orifice in the end of the stem. Cover the strainer opening with your hand and slowly turn the pilot valve on and off several times. Water should flow from the strainer opening in the on position and the relief valve should open, indicated by the amber light illuminating. In the off position, the water flow should stop and the relief valve should close and the green light should then illuminate. Next, check the strainer O-rings and replace them if needed. Then, replace the strainer assembly hand tight. With the pilot valve off, turn the pressure adjustment handle counterclockwise until it stops. Slowly turn the pilot valve on. The relief valve should once again open and the pump discharge pressure should decrease. Next, slowly turn the pilot valve back off. The relief valve should close and the pump discharge pressure should rise back to 150 PSI. Slowly open and close the pilot valve until the system responds quickly. This does mean within a few seconds of the valve being turned on or off. Finally, reset the pilot valve to the desired setting and decrease the engine speed to idle.